hello everyone in this video we will see how to create a sharepoint page and include html and css in that okay for that we need to create a web part page first and check whether uh, content editor is available okay so let's go and create one page here just go to the site contents and go to pages and create a new page new web part page here html css demo page and click create and now check add a web part and see here in media and content content editor web part will be available okay click add and you can see here content editor is available click add you can add the content or else uh, you can also add content in the like uh, if you want to add a design you can link a txt text file okay so so we need one sample html code now we, we will go to this uh, w3 schools and uh, check out <coughs> in w3 schools i am selected html and in html there is html layout and if you click here try it yourself you can get this html code okay just i copied all the html code and uh, pasted in my visual studio code here and i name it as html design dot text now let's uh, upload this in our site assets okay go to site assets and uh, this site assets are in modern view let's convert this into classic view so that we will get the link okay upload this html design text here open okay and it's got uploaded here and get the link here copy and give the txt in content editor you need to Just click it and you on the top you can get the correct path okay now go to HTML CSS and link it here and uh, you can also test link it is coming nice here and click OK and you can see the same layout coming here with all the CSS okay go to page now and click stop editing and you can see the same exact uh, layout which is available in w3 schools uh, is coming here also so this is uh, how we generally uh, place html and css um, in H in sharepoint pages uh, and also here if you see the html and css are together like in the same page we can we can also make it as uh, separate by taking a separate css file and linking here okay for now we can know we know how to <coughs> include html and css in the sharepoint page thanks for watching